Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Madin. Of course, you know you are listening here on SageTravel.com. So today, today I'll be talking about the Abuja to Kaduna train. Just in case if you have not subscribed, please hit the subscription button below. Like and share this video. Thank you. Abuja to Kaduna train has started again. You know, the train services were suspended because of the attack, but today they are back again. Not as usual. There are a lot of changes left and right. There are a lot of changes here and there, but everything is gradually coming back to normal. The government, they are trying their best to make sure that everything is back again of course security is very very important this time around they are putting the security of the passengers the properties of the passengers they are putting it they are just trying to guide it jealously this time around they are trying to guide everyone and of course the government they are really trying their best they are really working around the clock to make sure that they, they fix everything again now the new thing is that uh, the, the federal government now will now be monitoring everybody that is on board the train. They've been monitoring everybody. So where you're moving from, where you are to another place, the government know where you are. So they are monitoring everyone now. That's a new security measure. They are monitoring everything that is going on within the train. And if you want to book your train, of course, you know you can book online yourself or you can contact me to book for you. So if you want to book your train, you will need your NIN. National Identification Number. It's very, very important this time around. If you don't have your NIN, don't bother booking the train. You need your national identification number to book online. You need your national identification number when you are traveling because you need to present it. They will just want the sighting for them to see it. So when they look at it uh, at the uh, train station, they will allow you to enter. If you don't have your national identification number, they will not allow you to enter. That's the new rule. That's the new rule. You need your national identification number before you can be allowed to enter the train. And also, if you want to book the train, you also need your national identification number. If you already have the app, it's advisable for you to do what to update the app so that you can have this new feature uh, in your app. If you don't have the app, you can book directly on the website. You will need your NIN even when you're booking on the website. If you don't have it or you don't know how to book it, you can also reach out to me. I can assist you to book your train for you. So, so far, for now, the government will only be going to trips until when everything is back to normal. So, the first trip from Kaduna to Abuja will be by 8 a.m., while the first one from Abuja to Kaduna will be by 9 a.m. The second trip from Kaduna to Abuja will be by 2 p.m., while the last one from Abuja to Kaduna will be by 3 p.m. The government may change this time timetable. They may change it. They may increase it. In case if you want to book your train, you can go ahead and book your train now. You want to travel with the um, Nigeria Railway Corporation. You want to travel with the train, go to Kaduna or come back from Kaduna to Abuja. You can do it now. Everything is back online. Everything is back to normal. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to hit the subscription button below. Like and share this video. If you have a question, drop it in the comment section below and I will assist you. Thank you.